Hi guys, in this video we are going to discuss about how to recognize a UPI ID. Uh, for those who does not know what is UPI ID, it is a kind of a unified payment interface uh, which is created by uh, Indian government company called NPCI. It has helped me a lot, so I don't carry a purse nowadays when I'm traveling local. So everything is done through my mobile. Okay, so why I came to this video? Uh, so if I can zoom in and go over here. So there is a one query raised by one of the subscriber. I'm not sure if it's a subscriber, but one of the comment in the videos that uh, he or she trying to recognize uh, UPI ID, if you see over here. Uh, so I told her uh, that there is a regex available, but uh, with the alphanumeric, uh, there is an error occurred that this well the, the regex is not a valid right again that is true for the special characters and all so uh, what i found uh, for this solution right uh, we have instead of alphanumeric we have to use something called uh, system entity form field something like that which accept any input okay Okay, so let's move to our uh, Lex side. Uh, this is the Lex bot I have already created. Since this video is more towards targeting how to recognize a UPA ID, uh, uh, so we will concentrate on that part. Okay, so the flow is nothing but uh, we are first saying hi, welcome to XYZ, and then we are saying in the slot side uh, that uh, this is a slot name that I have given UPA ID and I'm collecting input as free from input. Since uh, we are not able to use the regex, so what I did is instead of uh, creating a slot, uh, which will validate the input, we will go to the Lambda to perform the regex, okay? So if you see over here, uh, we're just playing out uh, UPID and I'm collecting free from input, okay? Nothing else is over here, no success and failure and once uh, user is input right uh, user provides some input over here what we are doing is we are going to a lambda okay and if the lambda is returned successful we are saying something like that otherwise we are saying it's not valid okay so uh, let's test it out oh before testing out uh, so this is a lambda which I have already created. Uh, the script is already uploaded into uh, my GitHub. Okay, so the code is already there. I will put the code into or the link of this GitHub in my description section of this video. Okay, so what this lambda is doing is nothing but uh, we are getting the input transcript, right? We can get through slot also. So I found since it is a free text uh, there is no point of using slot uh, so what I'm doing is assigning to the variable then I'm using a regex you will notice that this regex is little bit different than what I have mentioned in the comment over here so what I did is I did little bit of validations and found that this is much more appropriate since what we are checking is alpha numeric character then there is a add the rate which is not supported by lex uh, alphanumeric and then again uh, bank name right uh, so it is like okay ICCI or the blue YL is bank so minimum three character is required uh, or more than three is supported right so that is what I have created the regex over here uh, what I'm doing is if it is found or it matches the regex then we are saying found uh, and then we are setting the result match and this is a return that I am passing to the welcome intent and this is like if it is fulfilled is means success or failed means fail right so let's go to over here uh, I will say hi so it will play from this uh, green box right welcome to the read to manual please provide the UPID so let me provide a wrong UPID like Raji so it will say sorry UPID Rajiv is not provided please provide the valid UPID so if I provide something like uh, okay I see CI uh, which is a bank name then it is a validated one right uh, we can test any other uh, uh, UPID also so let's go with like uh, Virat 
Kohli at the red uh, YBL years back right and it also accepted right so so yeah this is how uh, we can do uh, validation or recognition of UPI ID uh, which is not part of the system entity list provided by the Lex uh, but over here what we can do is we can use the free form and then use our lambda or the code side to validate it so hopefully you like the video uh, before moving on uh, just wanted to say that uh, uh, like the videos so 86 86 percent of people are not like uh, subscribing to the channel so do subscribe and let's target for at least uh, how many likes uh, let's go with uh, 22 likes for this video have a nice day thank you